everyone and welcome back to my channel so today's video is going to be an empties video and it's going to be a mini review so i have these many things and i'm going to tell you if i like them or i don't if i'm going to buy them again or no so this time i have a lot of products in here so let's begin so my first product today is by the body shop this is almond milk body yogurt for sensitive skin so as you can see i've completely emptied this um this smells good it's a nice product but i personally will not be buying this again because i have very dry skin and this isn't uh, very much um, a moisturizing cream for me i have to keep applying this all the time so i do not think i have the patience to do that so this is a complete no but you guys should give this a try this is a good product it it is for some someone with normal skin not someone who has extremely dry skin so this is a big no from me this is the body shop yogurt milk body yogurt and the next product is the flake away by soap and glory i think i've already mentioned about this product couple of times in my other videos if not the link will be up here so this product is really really good every time i go out of town i go to dubai i buy this product it's really nice for anybody who likes exfoliating their skin you can exfoliate your whole body with this and this stuff will last you for really long this is a uh, 300 ml and i don't really remember how much this costs i think this costs about 45 dirhams but here in india it is also available on amazon so i will leave the link for all these products online links for all these products in the description below so if you guys want to shop them there's nike there's amazon so you guys can check it out this is a big yes for me this is the flake away by soap and glory then it's a himalaya face wash it says tan removal orange face wash so i've used this um, twice i've used this bottle two times and i don't think this is actually a tan removal but it refreshes your skin so and it doesn't get your skin dry as well so this is something i would use especially if maybe i'm going on a winter holiday or it's going to get cold during the winters this is really nice this is not really a tan removal um, face wash but it's a good moisturizing face wash anyone with normal skin anyone with dry skin i would not um, recommend this for oily skin but anyone with normal skin yes this is a big yes from me so if you're thinking what happened to my hair it looks very different today i'm actually testing out a new hair conditioner and shampoo so i have let it air dry and let's see how well this works out as of now it looks decent it looks like any other shampoo but if it's amazing i'm going to be making a special video on that so we'll talk about the product in another video so the next product i'm going to talk about is the garnier skin naturals micellar oil infused cleansing water this one you guys know i love this this must have been my 100 bottle this is one of the best makeup removers i've ever used it's a very very big yes from me This costs two hundred and twenty-five rupees for one hundred and twenty-five ml. I like this bottle than the bigger one because this is easier when you're traveling around. And I'm usually going up and down three fifty kilometers here and there. So, okay, it's gone. So I'm gonna buy that again, and I recommend all of you all to buy that as well. It's really, really, really good. Then the next product is by L'Oreal Professional, the Pro Keratin Liz Unlimited Shampoo. So this is the bottle and it's already empty. So this costs 635 rupees and it's 300 ml. The shampoo is really good and it just makes your hair beautiful. You know that you have good hair or you know that you don't have good hair, but you can still use the shampoo and make your hair look good, feel good. You can just air dry your hair if you if your hair is something like mine that you don't have to blow dry it or straighten it all the time. then you can just use this this will work perfectly well for you and this also is more like an anti frizz so it won't frizz out your hair this is a very big yes from me a very big recommendation do use this one along with the conditioner so i'm not showing you the conditioner because the conditioner is not empty yet so i'm going to buy more bottles of this this one's amazing i love this one then the biotic advanced ayurveda saffron you do ageless moisturizer so i have used many bottles of this as well 
This one smells very Ayurvedic. I don't think you can see it's completely empty. There you go. Okay, so this one's completely empty. I have used this one and this one's good as well. This tub will last you a month if you're wearing this like three times a day, but I wear it two times a day. It lasts me about a month and a half. This one's really good for anybody with dry skin. Most of the biotic products you see in the market, you know, they cater to people who have really dry skin, especially around the T-zone. That's a very weird place to get dry skin, but that's where I have my problems. So this is a big yes from me the biotic saffron nude juice so the next product is by soap and glory again it's the clean on me uh, creamy clarifying sh uh, shower gel so this is how the bottle looks if you've seen my dubai haul i've shown this product here this is a 500 ml bottle and i think it costs about 50 dirhams or i'm not sure i'm not really sure about the cost because i bought it during the sale if you live in the middle east or if you live in uk this is available at um, the boots pharmacy so you can pick this up from there and do shop only during the sale because when boots goes on sale these products are always on sale and they literally go half the price otherwise you pay a lot more so this is a big yes from me it moisturizes your skin your your whole bathroom and you smell good literally this smell lingers on for at least six hours which is really good it's a very um nice bottle it's totally squashed by me but it's a very nice bottle it has a tube in here and it's a pump and also there's a lock but this is not something i would travel with because it's a little too big but if this comes in mini sizes, I would love to travel with this one. So this is a yes from me. Then I have last three products. So this one's a big no. This is a body shop uh, refreshing ice cube with vitamin E. So you can see I have used all of this. It's completely empty now. And this is a complete no. Apparently the store lady told it's good for dark circles. But... No, I've used this whole thing. I've used another bottle of this as well. And two times I've tried this out. It's about six months I've used this. And it has totally not worked for me. But if any one of you all watching my video right now who has used this, please tell me how it has worked out on you all. It hasn't worked out on me at all. I still do have dark circles and they are not nice. So if you guys know any product which I should try and it's really good for dark circles, please 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 do let me know but this one no a big no from me then there is one mascara this is by the l'oreal the fall slash superstar so there are two sides to this mascara one's the lash primer and one's the mascara so this is completely over Let's see it's just making those pucky sounds and then the other side it's completely over as well i couldn't use it today Today I'm wearing Scandalized by Rimmel. I couldn't use it today. Usually I'm always wearing this one. So this is completely over. And this is a big yes from me. Just that uh, you have to be careful that the mascara could dry out. And also the primer may remain. So if you're someone who likes wearing a mascara primer. I mean an eyelash primer. Then you can just keep this and use the primer off with other mascaras as well. And you, you know. Or you can just trash the whole thing and just buy this all over again. This is available on Nika and anywhere else in the country. And then the last product for the day is the Fit Me Foundation. I'm in the shade 230. So I think you guys already know that I use a lot, lot of Maybelline products. As of now, I've always been using Maybelline products, a lot of them. I started wearing makeup with Maybelline my first foundation was in 11 standard with again maybelline stick foundation so this one's very close to my heart i've been you i'm using it right now as well it's really good it matches my shade perfectly and no problems whatsoever but if you're somebody with skin like mine i would suggest you to you know make it more dewy because this is a mattifying um foundation so if you have to go do it so once you put everything on just use a setting spray like if you get giving one pump of setting spray i would recommend you to do two because i do two so that you know it doesn't look too dry on my skin uh, that helps me out so if you have skin like mine then i would recommend you to do the same so these are all the products i love and i hate guys so I hope you like my video. Thank you for watching. 
please comment, share, subscribe and show me some love.